here we are inside the State Farm office here. This is one of the main offices here. Closets. Pass through to another office slash conference room. Sliders out onto the deck and pond. This is an office three cubicle. Office four, also access onto the deck. Here's office five. Third access onto the deck. There's a full bathroom. Here we have reception, which is desk six. And there's a kitchen or employee break room area. Here we have the lower level. Some lights down here. So, more finished space. Down here, two additional offices. Down in the lower level here. We have the unfinished area. And there's another bathroom down here. Let's see if I can find a light. There you go. There's another full bathroom down here in the lower level, so two full baths. That's forced air furnace. This property is on well and septic. But the city water and sewer are available at the property. Mechanical stuff. I got some servers and things down here and other different components. Water heater and additional storage. There's your electrical panels and timers for the fountain in the back back there. That's what you're seeing there in that panel. And then here is a modern 200 amp service panel. Take you on the other side of the office here first before I go outside. Here's tenant number two, B windows. Now over here on this side. Let me unlock this here. Okay. This is their showroom here. So they have a full bath. Or excuse me, a half bath. There's no shower here. So a nice updated bath here with some additional storage in it. Over here is about 540 square feet. They have a nice showroom. Two offices. Office one. Kind of a hall area to the back area where the pond is. Office two. And then this could be a third office or it's additional display space for them. There's that door that goes into the kitchen area from the other space. And they have access out onto the deck and the pond here. So that's nice. Now I'll do a quick video of the outside. Here's the parking lot. Very nice parking area, 
mature landscaping. There's some very attractive brick and stone elements on the outside of the building here. With vinyl railings, covered porch. Going off to the side here, this sits at the intersection of Cleveland Road and the 31 Bypass, which has easy access to the toll road, the airport, and everything else in town. This is a very good location. It's also situated at the front of a high-end neighborhood called the Villas at Lake Blackthorn, which has 100 home sites and currently 60 high-end homes in it. It's a great place for a business to be situated. And of course, you have the deck back here looking out over this pond. The pond is on an easement, so it's maintained by the Villas at Lake Blackburn Neighborhood Association, but you get the benefit of the pond in the back. And there's some great outdoor space out here where you can have events, where employees can have lunch out here. It's a really good space. There you have it.